Hello, and welcome to Historical Humans Reads, where we take primary sources and bring them to your screen. I'm Cullum Coleman, and today we are reading from Kojiki, or the Record of Ancient Things. Composed in 712 CE during the Nara period by Ono Yasumaro, it is the oldest surviving written work from Japan. It was commissioned to establish a clear line of descent from the Shinto gods, specifically the sun goddess Amaterasu, to the Japanese emperors of the 7th and 8th century. To this end, it details the gods, the creation of the world, and the genealogy of the emperors of Japan up to the reign of Empress Suiko in 628 CE. With that, let's begin. The names of the deities that were born in the plain of high heaven when the heaven and earth began were the deity master of the august center of heaven. Next, the high august producing wondrous deity. Next, the divine producing wondrous deity. These three deities were all deities born alone and hid their persons. The names of the deities that were born next from a thing that sprouted up like onto a reed shoot when the earth young and like onto floating oil drifted about Medusa-like, were the pleasant reed shoot prince elder deity, next the heavenly eternally standing deity. These two deities were likewise born alone and hid their persons. The five deities in the above list are separate heavenly deities. The names of the deities that were next born were the earthly eternality standing deity next the luxuriant integrating master deity these two deities were deities likewise born alone and hid their persons the names of the deities that were born next were the deity mud earth lord next his younger sister the deity mud earth lady next the germ integrating deity next his younger sister the life integrating deity Next, the deity Elder of the Great Place. Next, his younger sister, the deity Elder Lady of the Great Place. Next, the deity Perfect Exterior. Next, his younger sister, the deity O Awful Lady. Next, the deity The Male Who Irrevites. Next, his younger sister, the deity The Female Who Invites. From the earthly eternally standing deity down to the deity, the female who invites in the previous list are what are termed the seven divine generations. The two solidarity deities above mentioned are each one called a generation or the succeeding 10 deities pair of the deities is called a generation. Hereupon all the heavenly deities commanded the two deities, his Augustusness, the male who invites and her Augustusness, the female who invites, ordering them to make, consolidate, and give birth to this drifting land, granting to them a heavenly jeweled spear, they thus deigned to charge them. So the two deities, standing upon the floating bridge of heaven, pushed down the jeweled spear and stirred with it, whereupon when they had stirred the brine till it went curdle-curdle and drew up the spear, the brine that dripped down from the end of the spear was piled up and became an island. This is the island of Onagoru. This has been an excerpt from Kojiki on Historical Humans Reads. If you enjoyed this video and would like to hear more excerpts from original texts, please follow or subscribe to us on your platform of choice. If there is a work you would like to hear, be sure to like the video and leave a comment down below. Thank you for listening.